and welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited that you're here. I am pumped for today's video. It is fall. Leaves are kind of changing, but we are going full throttle. I've got a candle. I think it's pumpkin cinnamon candle going on on the side. We're in that mindset and I'm so excited. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a fall get ready with me look. This is the final product, but at the second half of the video, I'll be showing you how I created it. It's super easy. Not that many products are used. I think I did it in real time in under 15, 10 minutes. So it's super, super easy. And we are getting to use all of the new brand new eco tools products. You guys, if you've been following my channel for a while now, you know I've loved and have used EcoTools since basically the dawn of, well, the dawn of my time. And I love their products. And they have come out with six new unreal products that I am seriously so excited with. And I can't wait to get to show you guys. I know you're gonna love them. All right, first and foremost, we have the Vibrant Vibes. Okay, you guys, I used, I think, all of the brushes in this look, but I love, love, love this product. So this includes four uniquely designed brushes that are jade infused. Jade infused, you guys. I love, love, love these brushes. So I brought some of them out so you can see them when I was using them. But I wish there was like a, not a scratch and sniff feature, but like a scratch and feel feature on YouTube because these just feel like seriously so soft. Like I have a very airbrushed feel because of these products. This also comes into a, or comes with a gold storage tray, which is so super handy. I feel like I'm able to travel with this. I'm also able to put it on my beauty counter without Nate getting mad because it doesn't take up too much space. <laughs> which is always a necessity. So this is awesome. Super, super excited for you guys to try this out. This second one may be my favorite. I know I'll probably say that about all of them, but this honestly, I can't get more hype about. This is the Crystal Perfecting Blender. Now, if you've tried any of other EcoTools Perfecting Blenders, you know how amazing these blenders are. They blend everything out so, so well. They are 71% plant-based, but this shape is unreal. So I took it out and I just used it. It's a little wet, so it's bigger. This is awesome. My favorite areas of this are this little tip because I can reach into that tear duct area. Y'all, it's never been so blended. Like it gets me so <laughs> excited because that area is so difficult. Also right here in that crease is super difficult to reach but these edges and all these corners, you guys. <sighs> You can see in the second half of this video how I use this, but it is just such a great product to blur out any blemishes and to kind of really create that airbrush look that we all love. It's awesome. This one has the cutest packaging. This is the Glossy Finish Kit. Now it has three Jade Infused brushes, which are awesome. But these are going to be great for powders and eyeshadows and all that kind of stuff. This one's going to be a great bronzer and highlighter one because it's angled. So it also comes with these two crystal hairpins. One's like a light lilac. This is like a millennial pink color. It's so and I love this. I love how they have this whole jade crystal thing going on. It's awesome. All right, so this is gonna be something that you did not know you needed, but now that you need. This is the I Need To Prep and Refresh Kit because we forget all the time how important it is to take care of our skin and to take care of our brushes. Now, what I love about EcoTools is that they are such a reminder of we're not trying to cover up anything on our face. We're just trying to enhance the beauty that we all already individually have, which is awesome. But something that helps that is healthy skin and taking care of it. And something that I always forget, but I love that Eco Tools reminds us of is to wash our brushes. We have a how-to card, a drying kit, a trifecting wedge. We have some of these really amazing concealer sticks. We also have a shampoo brush cleaning pack. So this is going to be so, so great. It's teaching you how to clean your brushes. There's a drying rack inside here. Let me actually grab it so you guys can see what it looks like. It's a drying rack that you can just lay your brushes on whenever you clean them. So they're gonna be drying super well. They're gonna be staying cleaner. You're gonna be able to use product better. If you clean your brushes, not only does it help your skin, but it helps you lay on product better. So clean your brushes, clean your face, prep and refresh your life. Okay, so this next product I've been using every single second of every day. I just wanna go like this the entire time. So this is the 360 Ultimate Sheet. If you remember the 360 Ultimate Blends from a while ago, this is basically their little sister. So the 360 Ultimate Blend brushes from EcoTools were really great at foundations and seriously airbrushing it out, but these are so, so great with powder. So I used today, you can see the second half of this video, I did a powder foundation on top of some of my liquid contouring, and then I also used the same brush for my translucent powder. And what I love about this is that you can seriously buff it out. And it's such a large face of a brush that you feel like you're able to really get it in and buff out and really control whatever you're wanting to. So this is amazing. 360 Ultimate Sheer. Shalom Pow. All right, now last but certainly not least is the Travel and Glow. So this one is basically made for the girl on the go. If you're going to the gym in the morning, gym to meeting, and then you're going from your work to nighttime and you're wanting to spruce up that makeup, 
this is for you. Okay, so let me read everything in here because it's jam-packed. So inside here, we have the square foundation, a detailing brush, the travel bag, the sculpting brush, and blotting papers to use whenever you are on the go. This is awesome. I love that it comes in this gym bag. Again, I can throw this in my purse and be good to go for the rest of the day for all my brushes because this seriously has everything you need from foundation to eyes, to bronzer and blush. You can even use this one for highlighter. This one's gonna be awesome. So those are the six new items. Y'all, they're amazing. Let's just hold them one more time in my arms. Yay! This is so awesome. All right, so these are gonna be some of my absolute favorite products. I cannot wait for you guys to get your hands on these. These are amazing. And now we're gonna show you how I got this little makeup look right here. Super easy, super fast, using some of my favorite products here. Let's get started. So I'm gonna be using some of my absolute favorites from those six new products that I showed you guys. And starting it off, we're going to be using the Crystal Perfecting Blender. Oh, I'm so excited for this. So to start off, I have a little bit of moisturizer already on my face, but I'm going to be taking uh, this Tarte Shape Tape in the color Fair Neutral. I'm going to be kind of uh, contouring my face. Since fall, we're gonna be keeping it light so we don't feel like it's sticking to our face like we're cakey because I feel like and sometimes in the colder weather when I have too much makeup on, I feel like you can really see it. So we're gonna be kind of keeping this natural, but also keeping it warm as well. Y'all, I've never been able to get that close to my tear duct and blend. Oh, that was the most exciting thing ever. Okay, so now we're gonna take a little shade darker. Um, so these are their Shape Tape Concealer and Contouring Sticks, which I love, kind of create and mix with my foundations. The color uh, Light Neutral. All right, now with the third shade darker, words, we're gonna be taking, this is the light medium, I'm gonna be putting it in my contour lines and warming up the outside of my face, it's giving my face a little bit more dimension. Y'all, this is my new favorite thing. This is awesome. All right, all right, next up, we're gonna be putting some powder on with our 360 Ultimate Cheer. This is, again, I'm so excited for you guys to just see how this works. This is gonna help with super lightweight application. I'm gonna be using a color foundation first, a color powder foundation um, on top of this, and then I'm gonna be using my translucent Laura Mercier that I use with everything to kind of bake and set all my makeup. This is awesome. I love it so much. I feel like I can just buff and buff and buff until I feel like I have like this flawless foundation, which is awesome. All right, so now we're gonna be using uh, the Translucent Laura Mercier, my favorite, and we're gonna be using this exact same brush because in the fall, again, I like to keep my makeup as cake-free as possible. So using as little makeup and as makeup that I can make my face still feel lightweight and not caked on, it's gonna be awesome. Seriously, my new favorite brush. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna be using some of the Vibrant Vibes brushes. Now these are the jade infused ones. They're so much fun. We're gonna be warming up our face with some blush and some bronzer. Now I've been using this Too Faced Natural Face Palette. It has highlighter, blush, and bronzer, and it's basically all out. It's all you need on your face, which is awesome. So I'm gonna be taking a few of this blush. I like to mix them. And then again, starting from the outside and circling in. Here we go. Now for bronzer, we're gonna be doing the exact same thing. We're just warming it up. A little bit on the outside of our nose. And there we have a pretty natural, very easy to do fall contour. All right, next on the eyes. All right, so for our eyes, I'm using the other three brushes from that Vibrant Vibes kit. I'm gonna be using this as kind of an all over, this to kind of use that uh, transition color, and this underneath my eye. Okay, so my mom gave me the Kris Jenner Momager palette, and it's not my favorite palette. <laughs> So we're gonna be using this. But for our overall our eyes, we're gonna be using this I Love Myself color with that larger um, brush. This is actually the controlled setting powder. So I'm gonna be using that all over our eyelids. All right, next up we're gonna be using this angled crease brush. Now this does have an angle, and what I really like about it is you can literally just get in that angle and just go like this, and it does the work for you. We're gonna be using um, this color on the second row. It is one of my absolute favorite colors. I feel like it's a really pretty transition. Now it's very pigmented, so I like to brush it off and be sure that, because you can always add more, part of your takeaway.
All right, and we are also going to take this. This is the uh, flat eyeliner brush. We're gonna be dipping that in the exact same color and going underneath of our eyes. Fall color palette is so orangey and fun and red and purple and burgundies and so warming up of our face and warming up our eyes is kind of the inspo for that. We're basically putting fall leaves on top of our eyes. Not really, but you get the point. All right, we're gonna do that simple eye real quick. It's only one color, two colors, I guess, but I still really love it. I feel like it's warm. Next, we're gonna do some brows. I have been loving this um, L'Oreal Brow Shape and Fill. It's awesome. I've been using the color Blonde, I think. Apparently, blonde. <laughs> Let's do that. So this is my new favorite mascara. I have not branched out since seventh grade and I wish I did earlier because this is the best thing ever. This is Voluminous Last Paradise from L'Oreal. I like to go on top of my eyelashes and then go from underneath basically a thousand times, not really, more like 10, but that's how I like to get it and it's phenomenal. Like the difference, come on. The difference, I mean. For a fall lip, I always love to going for warm nudes and then a little bit of darker mauvey colors. So we're gonna be using this Kylie Jenner. This is the color Todd Cranes. I am probably pronouncing that wrong, but it's awesome. Highlighter, totally forgot about it, but we're still good. I'm going to be using the contour setting one from the Vibrant Vibes palette. Vibrant Vibes kit, this is the palette we're using. And we're going to be taking the upper one, Starlight, and putting it in our highlighted areas. And then we're basically good to go. And there you have it, folks. That is our fall makeup tutorial. Fall get ready with me. Super quick and easy. I'll probably be doing this makeup look on the daily for the rest of the fall. Super warm, fun, easy to do. Not that many products are used, and we are using all of the new Eco Tools items. They are jade infused. They are amazing. They are eco friendly. You guys already know that I've been using them since the dawn of time. I love them. I'm so excited to get to show you guys these products. They're my new favorite ones. If you like this video, please unsubscribe and hang out with me some more. We have fun over here. And as always, so much love.